In the third game of Toro the Bull, he has allied himself with rival Diaz Jr., whose ancestor is said to hunt somewhere in Egypt. The odd radar pair must head there and make sure the now mummified Captain Diaz doesn't get his hands on the Book of Toro. As alluded to in the name, this is a sort of apoph of the well-known Book of Dead from Play and Go, which in turn is inspired by a classic Novomatic slot from 2005 called Book of Ra, but there are, of course, models from real Vegas machines as well. There are plenty of Book of Games so accusing ELK Studios of plagiarism is unfair, and in the Swedish game studio's defense, they put their own stamp on the concept. Of course, they take the Wandering Wild feature from the original Wild Toro and the sequel to help, but as I said, Diaz Jr. and Toro are allies here and instead it's mummified Captain Diaz who has to watch out for Toro's onslaught, which leaves Wilds in its wake. As befits Book of Games, unlimited free spins with expanding symbols are the order of the day in the bonus round. The slot comes with a nice oriental soundtrack that works very well in the long run, which is unusual for slots where you all too often get bored quickly. It acoustically sets the Egyptian theme where we play on a classic 5x3 set. The game makes use of fixed pay lines that are 10 in number. The bet range goes at most online casinos all the way up to $100 per spin, minimum 20 cents. The Book of Toro slot machine has an RTP of 95.0%, which is worse than its two predecessors. The maximum win is 10,000 times the base bet, which is significantly higher than the original 2250 but identical to Wild Toro 2. The game, like the other Wild Toro games, is powered by the Wandering Toro Wild symbol. As in most Book of Games, the bonus symbol also acts as the wild symbol, which means that you often get a bit of a band-aid on your wounds even when you miss out on getting to the free spins round. It also follows the classic mechanic of first being randomly assigned a symbol that will expand throughout the bonus round. During the free spins, Book of Toro also makes use of what are called scatter pays. This only applies to the expanding symbol and means that these do not have to be consecutively adjacent to each other. The paylines are still used, but there can be other symbols on wheels between them. Note that low value symbols require at least 3 symbols to pay, and medium and high value symbols only require 2. Also worth mentioning is that Toro will expand when used with an expandable symbol, which is often the case. During free spins, additional free spins and up to a total of 3, 3, expanding symbols can be activated. If you maximize the number of expanding symbols, you will only be awarded free spins, according to the same payout as in the base game, see above. There is no upper limit to the number of free spins, but the bonus round will end when you hit the maximum win of 10 comma x Book of Toro is a very nice looking game aesthetically. With several different features, this adds some extra spice to this release from the LK. Speaking of the LK, the Toro series has become one of the studio's premier slots, and it's nice that they've moved away from the bullfighting theme to develop the characters in a different direction.